we are having a Today's the day. We are at our 20 week ultrasound appointment. Well, I'm at our 20 week ultrasound appointment. I'm by myself, this is so weird. I'm not used to being by myself for these appointments. This is what it is right now. This is what we're dealing with, with COVID-19. So Marcus can't be here with me. This appointment I wanted my, I wanted Jayla to be here. Like I wanted all of us to be here so that we can all see the little baby all together we're gonna get that I think it's like an hour-long ultrasound is what we're gonna be doing today so I'm really excited but I'm also like really sad at the same time I really 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 wanted Marcus to be at this appointment but this is what this is what we have right now so I am trying to drink as much water as I can because I know I'm gonna have to use the bathroom. Now I'm gonna have to pee in a cap. I emptied my bladder this morning and I was like, dang it, I should not have done that, but I had to go. Like, this child pushes on my bladder already. And that's why I'm like, how big is this person inside of me? How big is this baby? Because this baby's already pushing down on my bladder so much. Also, sleeping is not the best thing in the world anymore. Like if you know me, you know that sleep is like everything to me. Like it's like my number one thing to do in the world. But I can't sleep, like I can't sleep and it's very uncomfortable to sleep. So all of that combined, it's just like a mess. It's a hot mess. I do have my mask. Uh, they called me yesterday to let me know that if I did have anybody coming with me that they would have to stay in the foyer um until it was time for me to actually go into the ultrasound room so i was like i'll just go by myself instead of just doing all that it just seems like a, such a huge hassle and so i have my mask um this is my mask and it has like a filter that goes in it 
my dad actually found these i think in tennessee i think that's where he was my dad's a truck driver so he was able to find these in tennessee and i have my gloves and i think i think i'm probably just gonna use like one at a time just so i have one that's you know germy and the other my hand is like free and like not germy and also has clorox wipes it's just so crazy how different things have become now like when i walked out of the house this morning i got in the car and was like wait a minute i don't have i don't have gloves i need to go back so i had to go back in the house get some gloves come back to the car and then i was like wait a minute i need some clorox wipes and so i had to go back to the house get some more clorox wipes and it's just crazy how differently you think about things now it's, it, i never thought about what i what i touched before like i never thought about how many things i touched and now i just when i'm out because i don't i don't really go out at all i cannot imagine like if i were to catch something and then possibly give it to jayla like i can't imagine my baby being in a hospital room by herself without me I, I couldn't do it like I would have to tear the hospital down like having to leave from going being home all the time to now having to go into a doctor's office it's a little stressful so my allergies are like real life can I just say these things need to go away like I'm so tired of my allergies my nose is dry which my skin is dry anyways with this pregnancy but my god like my nose is peeling like it hurts i have like it just hurts so bad and i'm sneezing all the time like i need these allergies to go away and like allergies and this virus at the same time does not go together like everybody looks at you sideways so i'm hoping that i don't sneeze in the middle of my appointment because i don't want the nurse to be like this what you got going on So I just got back from my doctor's appointment and we got to see the little baby. This child is already stubborn, already stubborn like the whole time. Everything looks good. Um, the baby is measuring right on time. Um, I think she said about 14 ounces and it's measuring right on time. Like I'm um, 20 weeks and like four days today. So everything looks good, which is really exciting. The appointment really honestly was really different than, um, you know, normal appointments. As soon as you walk into the, the office, they screen you, they check your temperature, you know, they ask you questions. Um, I didn't even have to open the door myself. The nurse opened it for me. Uh, I didn't have to sign anything. Um, they don't, you know, there's literally no contact at all for anything so today's the day that i'm going to tell you guys what we're having we are having a 